Alrighty guys, so thanks for joining me. This is your host ID Jester. Welcome to John Tiller's Panzer Battles. This is the uh, Panzer Battle Kursk. And we are playing scenario number 0705 underscore 09A Butuvo, the gatekeepers of Cherkaskayo. Cherkaskayo. Kaye, Kaske, something like that. Apologize, I'm probably mispronouncing that incorrectly. Uh, we will actually 7509A, um, 075. So here's the outline of it um, it's 13 turns long, Bulotoo, northwest of Tomor, Toma. Rovka, Tomarovka, July 5th, 1943. Scenario size is regiment. Head-to-head, uh, -head, we're actually playing this scenario. It's the same thing, but it's uh, German human versus the Soviet AI. The farming village of Boroto, nestled between the hill 231.9 and 236.5. The high ground and crude buildings made Boroto the logical area to fortify. The 3rd Battalion... 199th Guards Rifle Regiment had dug in forward of the main Soviet lines to act as a breakwater against the expected German attack. Oberst Hans Bokelsen of the 111th Panzer Grenadier Regiment was tasked with clearing the village, a mission that was considered a minor act but would take much longer than expected. So that is our scenario. We have 13 turns, uh, so I just wanted to read that off to you. We're actually here at the end of turn number three because as the Germans, we start all the way down here, down by Voskoki. Voskoki. All of our units are located down here in the bottom of the map. It's taken us actually uh, three turns just to get them into the positions that we have got them to. So I figured I would save some time and uh, get us right into the action here uh, based upon you know getting our units closer here so you can see the objectives here kind of in the around Botovo and around hill 236 and 231 there's an objective way in the back our info is 70 points for minor victory 90 points for a major victory uh, and you can see we've pretty much moved everything up in travel mode at this point. Uh, and we're ending our turn. I actually got the tanks up here pretty quickly, but I didn't want to send in the tanks until we have some support. Because Kursk, East Front action here, uh, we can only see, uh, we don't see any of the enemies They haven't shot at us. And there's usually tons and tons of mines all over the place. And so I wanted to get some engineers. You can see we've gotten a few engineer units closer to the front. We haven't got them there yet. To hopefully start clearing out some of these mines and also get some of our mortar units uh, set up here on the hill. So they can start shooting. I thought we had another mortar unit Mm, that only shows one there. Oh, this one somehow got moved when I moved this guy. Huh. All right, well, that's kind of a bummer. Oh, well, we're just going to have to deal with it and move on. All right, so we're going to end our turn here, end of turn number three, as I mentioned. We might actually now get to see if there's any enemies around. Well, here comes some artillery. Ooh, eight men there. That was a hard hit. War units, hard hit there. All right, air units are available. Smoke available at 10. One unit recovered some fatigue. All right, so let's see what kind of air mission we have. We actually have a... 
JU-87D, a flight of those units, but we don't see anybody because it's grayed out. So if I was to say, how far can you go? You can only go one space. We're going to change you out of travel mode because I have a feeling when we come up on top of this hill, he's going to get shot. Actually, he didn't, which is a little bit surprising. Okay. Maybe there is no uh, Russians in this scenario. Uh, let's take you out of uh, travel mode as well. We'll start bringing this guy around to the flank. Take him out. Uh, oops. Uh, yeah, why is it uh, change travel mode? I can't because he already moved too many points. Okay. <sighs> I should probably, let's see, this has got a range of nine hexes. Let's see, where can you make it to? I'd like to get him up on the hill somewhere where he can spot. So, hmm. You know what? I am actually going to bring him back. It's kind of a waste, but unfortunately, I'll take him out of travel mode. I did not mean to move him up to begin with, so that's. I'll take this guy out of travel mode. So these guys are set up now. This is a. What is this? Like an AA soft half track. Alright. A range of five against infantry. They just won't shoot at us. That's the problem. I'm going to leave that guy there. I'm going to actually leave that on so we can move up some units here quickly. Uh, let's bring these guys there. You see some of these units in the back are kind of slow. Alright, who's left? Alright. And then, of course, we have our commander here, which happens to be Oberst uh, Blolson, which is what we read about. He was in charge of this, uh, what was it, 111th Panzer Grenadier. So we're just going to keep him back. He's got uh, 31 range, so that should keep everyone well within his range. There are... Several other headquarter units. We shall look at those because it's ultra important. Uh, headquarter. So you, your units, organization. So all those guys are part of that unit except for this guy. And where was our other headquarters? Hello, headquarters. Where are you? I think there was one more headquarter unit. Oh, I gotta remember what the key is. Highlight headquarters is, headquarters is L. Of course it's L. Yeah, there he is back here. And he's part of, hmm, all right. Cool. Uh, what's your command range, buddy? 24 X's. What about you? 24. So should keep everyone well within range. Hi, what's going on, my friend there? K Nag says push harder. The clock monster is ticking. Yeah, it's taking us. This is the end of turn four. And we are just getting to the edge of the hills here. 
he says to push harder, but um, let's take this guy out of travel mode. Oops, out of travel mode. Well, I guess I'm going to push these guys there. I know there's going to be mines everywhere as soon as we get up here. We just haven't spotted the mines yet. So I hate to keep pushing harder and harder. I'm going to get that guy behind the hill there. Get that guy behind the hill. Take this guy out of uh, travel mode. That would be... Oh, because I already exceeded his allowance. Damn. We're pushing as hard as we can, my friend. Let's take him out of travel mode. Okay. This guy can actually move. Push him right up the top there. I'm trying to push as hard as I can, but... I think everyone's in red movement, except for this guy. And these tanks. But I hate to move up the tanks, like I said. We don't want to lose our tanks to mines. Like that. Well, we lost a vehicle. Yep, there's mines in that hex. Yeah, I should have known that because it says right there, clearing mines. Ah. Shite. Alright, I think that's the end of turn. Could push these guys a little bit farther, but hmm. All right, I pushed him, I pushed him. We want to do the end of turn four already. Yeah, it's only 13 turns, but I have a feeling turns five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 are going to be crazy. We're moving as fast as we can. All right, let's see what the... Uh, it's funny that they can spot us, but we can't spot them. Interesting. They can spot us, but we can't spot them. Oh, lost another vehicle. All right, every units are available. Smoke is available. Units clearing mine obstacle at rubble, and one unit recovered some fatigue. Yep. Let's bring this engineer up. Yep, he's cleaning clearing mines. So they're gonna have, they're gonna have this whole area mined. So we either have to just. Uh, Yep, mines there. All right, the mines are not here anymore. Right. All right, well, let's see if our artillery or our uh, mortars. Oh my gosh. Where are our subordinate? Well, right there's one. What are you talking about? Can't see this unit. Oh, I see. This mortar goes with these guys over here. Ah, I gotcha. Well, this guy will be able to shoot him, though. 
Come on, boys. Let's take this guy out of travel mode at least. Stacking limitations, huh? I'm going to bring this guy all the way around behind. Take him out of travel mode. I'll bring him up next turn. Oh, good lord. Let's bring our engineers up there. Yep, clearing mines. Oops. Get our engineers up here. Gotta be a guy in there. Good lord. I think they forgot to put uh, Russians in the map or something. <laughs> no, I, I know there's got to be guys here. There are, I don't know how many, but there's got to be some. All right, let's see if we can. <sighs> see this unit. Let's see about air mission. All right. I'm going to try and bring these guys into the actual town. Oh, there's mines there. these guys can go. <sighs> I don't know what's going on there, Al Red Sox fan, my friend. What is going on? Hopefully all is well. He's listening to me at work. Well, I'll try to make your last bit of your work day go by faster for you. Uh, I guess we should try and attack this guy here for no effect. Well, there was our... You can clear mine. 
lines. So we got this guy as well. up there that's fine uh, engineer can't move oh, that's right he's queering mines This guy too. Come on, get up the hill, boys. Run. We only have two vehicles in this. If we lose one to mines, I'm not going to be very happy. We already lost one vehicle unit to mines. All right, I think save is. I think we're going to just let's see what happens. Well, we lost two guns up on the hill there. That's not good. Another gun. And got our guns completely illuminated. Smoke's available. We got one unit that's isolated. This guy's isolated. Uh, no, he's not. There's no way this guy's isolated. He can get supply right through this hex. Even if there was a enemy in this hex, we can still get supply through this hex. There'd have to be an enemy here. There's no enemy there. Hmm. Um, all right, so we cleared some mines. Cleared some more mines. So there's no mines in that hex. There's no mines in that hex. They say that this unit is isolated, which I really, really doubt. <sighs> All right, let's move up. Yep, more mines in that hex, so I want to keep my... All right, I guess we'll pull this guy back. What spaces are visible in this hex? Yeah, we got to get up to the edge if we want to be able to see anything. Hey, more mines. Uh, we're going to have to pull this guy up here. And more mines. Yay, we lost a gun. Uh, change the travel mode. Ah. 
right, we're gonna bring up. Shoot him, boys. Shoot him. Come on, boys. No more movement points. Tam. Yeah, so there's like mines literally everywhere. <sighs> Gotta take these guys out of travel mode because if I hit the mines, which I'm 99% sure there's going to be mines in that X. Oh, so there is unit there. We just don't know about it. All right, let's assault. Take these guys out of travel mode. Oh, well, there you go, more mines. Good. Just what I wanted to see. Oh, there's some more mines. Ay, 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 ay. There's mines in that hex. All right. Well, hopefully we can start shooting with some of these. Well, we actually got a disruption finally. Uh, let's oops. Let's go for this hex. Air mission JU-88s. Can I fire while in travel mode? Right. Ah, uh, shoot at those guns, boys. Shoot at those guns. guys are done. Change everything back out of travel mode. What a pain in the ass. <sighs> well. Oh, more mines. Good, good, good. Uh, yeah, see, there's something in there. We just can't get to it. That's great. More mines, right? Yep, yeah, okay. That means I'm not pushing my tanks forward. That's for damn sure. Oh, more mines. I don't know if I mentioned this, but uh, there's a lot of mines. Where are your spotters? Where are your spotters? B. I don't see any spotters for you. Why do I not see spotters for you? Let's go for men. Viper Dave, how you doing, my friend? Good to have you on board. That's it. Can't do anything else. Yeah, you can't literally go anywhere in this... in Kursk. Too many mines everywhere. Change travel mode. Oh, there we go. Lost all vehicle unit there. That's good. Just on mines alone. Yeah, 
Yeah, you guys, uh... No, not a lost a man! Ah. You guys, still waiting on you guys. Um, right. Travel mode either. Oh, uh, let's go. Let's go here. Let's go here. Most of it's not. Mines at Kursk? If you don't move that Russian, artillery will kill you, not the mines. Or the clock monitor. Got to get these victory points, says k -Nag. Yeah, I know, my friend. I, I'm... Yeah. 